Hello, hello, hi everyone. I uh, I had a phone call, so I had to I had to take it. I please apologize. I apologize for that. But thank you guys so much for being here. I am Sharon. I've been cooking and baking for 20 years, and tonight I'm going to be cutting summer fruit. So people have an issue. Hi, Marilyn. People have issues with like cutting like a pineapple and everything, and I'm going to show you exactly how to cut a good pineapple. Yes, it's summer fruit time. It's like so, we need that. We want good fruit. We want to learn how to cut them. We want to make sure that we maximize, you know, our our budget by buying like real whole fruits and everything like that and not in the can that way you know thank you so much thank you the better to see you with my dear <laughs> um we want to maximize our you know our shopping dollars by buying whole fruits you know not fruits in the can and everything like that so the more we learn how to cut them the more we'll be you know able to you know enjoy them you know wholeheartedly and stuff like that so I have my pineapple here, pineapple, and I'm going to get a knife, like a sharp knife, like it's important to have a good sharp knife, so I have my, where's my thingy, good sharpener. And I'm going to sharpen my knife because if you have a dull knife, you actually cut yourself worse or more on a dull knife as opposed to a sharp knife. So we're going to make sure it's nice and sharp and we're going to wipe off any of the, you know, metal and stuff on it. So I'm going to just pull this down and over so you guys can see what's going on. There we go. Boom. Okay. So, hi there. So, to cut a pineapple, first of all, you need to cut off the <laughs> the tag. We don't need the tag, okay? So, you want to take the pineapple and you want to cut the top first, okay? What is the top? It's it's where it has this beautiful like hat. I would call it a hat, okay? You want to cut that off, okay? Then put that off to the side. You want to set it up straight, okay? Now you want to cut around, okay? See inside here where it has like these little brown notch, notches in there? You want to cut that off too because that's part of all of this, okay? So what you want to do is take your knife and go around. Go around. Notice I didn't cut the bottom, okay? I did not cut the bottom, okay? Keep the bottom. Only cut the top first. I'm going around. Ooh, this smells amazing. So good. Go all the way around your pineapple, okay? Until all of this pieces, and try to get it as thin as you can, okay? You don't want to be cutting, like, huge chunks that way you know you don't want to cut away all of your pineapple meat like that would be sad <laughs> to say the least okay so keep it going just go around all right so there we go now we've cut all these little pieces off and if you have missed any pieces go back in and cut off all that green. There we go. Let's see here. There's a little more green there. And a little green there. Let's try to cut as thinly as possible, okay? That way you don't lose any of the meat, like I said, okay? Alright, we're going to throw that away. Throw all these away. See how thin they are, you guys? Look how thin that is, okay? You don't want to cut it all off. All right. So now that's all cut. You have a nice base. You didn't cut off the bottom yet because I didn't tell you to. Ha ha ha. Mother didn't may I didn't tell you. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> so now that we've gotten all that cut, now you want to go in, cut it 
down and make slices, okay? And you want them kind of thin too, okay? You don't want them so big and chunky. I mean, you can probably do it very chunky, but you know, quarter inch pieces would, is good. Yes, there we go, see? Look how pretty these pieces are, okay? Look at, all right, I'm going to cut this down here. That is it for this one. And that is the base, okay? You can probably cut a little bit more, but this bottom does not look as good. I'm still gonna cut it though, but I just don't, not really into it. <laughs> there we go. All right, we got all the way to the bottom. There is that. So now, now the middle is the piece that you don't want, right? So you take your stacks, put them, try to put them back in like order, okay? When you want to kind of take them, cut that, cut, cut, and then cut it again. And now you've cut all the middle out of your pineapple. So now you have nice chunks so you can go in and cut them in half and now you have all these beautiful pineapple chunks like one inch pieces okay and you just do that with all the rest of your pineapple okay I need to get a little thingy all right so we here's another beautiful piece of pieces of pineapple cut that in half again Cut. So we're cutting around that middle center piece. Okay. We cut the center piece off and out. Okay. It's not really edible, so you can just throw that piece away. And now you go back in and cut your one inch pieces for your pineapple. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right. I don't know what I was doing there, but I didn't cut it as thin as I wanted. It's all right, though. We'll still cut it. Cut. Cut. And cut. Throw that middle away. We got good one-inch pieces. Boom. There we go awesome we got beautiful chunks of pineapple last couple ones cut cut all the way around it we have a nice chunk there and we have the rest of them hi it um in one inch pieces so now you can you put this in like um <clears throat> you do you good <clears throat> so now you can put this in like a fruit salad you can decorate whatever you want you can add it in like food you can top it on your pizza whatever you like so i think i'm going to put this mom are we having pizza no we're not having pizza not um, I have roasted chicken and potatoes. Okay, so here we are. We've got a nice like little bowl. We're going to just transfer all this beautiful. Let me get a food mover. Here we go. Got a nice little mover. And we're just going to put that all in here. Okay. Don't drop here. This smells phenomenal. Now you have beautiful chunks of pineapple. And you didn't have to get it out of the can. Okay? Booyah. Isn't that awesome, you guys? 
Oh my goodness. So, and if you were like serving, you know, you can probably put this like in here and kind of make it look really cute and pretty and everything like that. If you're like doing some serving and whatnot. Otherwise, you can just throw this little hat away. Just throw it away. And so now we're done. We've already cut up our pineapple. Ah, if you missed it, um, hey, how you doing? If you missed it, you need to go back and check the replay. My replays have been fire in the last couple of days that I've been on here. Um, I stepped up my game. So thanks for inviting folks, Charles. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Thank you. So, yes, this is fire. Everybody is going to want to learn how to cut their pineapple and not get it out of a can, y'all. Just seriously. Don't do that. <laughs> Yes, love. Thank you. I appreciate you. So if you guys have any questions, put them down in the chat right now about pineapple. Otherwise, I'm going to get going. Yes, cutting yes, cutting real pineapple is a skill. It is a skill. It really is. And watermelon. And I have that too. Um, let me rinse my hands because my hands are really sticky. And then... Um, my son, we got this pot, we got this, and my son dropped it, and so as you can tell, it's a little jaggedy, but we could cut it too. Let's cut it. I dropped it, and now let's cut this So baby. let's go ahead and cut the watermelon too, so you guys I can see what our water, it. are you okay? I dropped it. Okay, all right. It looks like Pac-Man, Mom. It does look like Pac-Man, yeah, it does, like Pac-Man eating fruit. Bop, bop, bop. Okay. Now let's cut him. Ah! Simmer down. Hadouki. Jason. Jason. One, two, pineapple, back up. Pineapple, can I have some? You may have some pineapple. Okay, folks, we're going to cut a watermelon too, so check this out. All right. Bad signal. Got to catch the replay. Okay, baby, thank you. All right, so I'm going to just cut it through here because my son dropped it. So we're just gonna cut Oh, that. that looks bad inside. Yeah. Sorry, Mom. Oh, that's what happens when you drop the watermelon. But we're gonna make, we're gonna work it out. We are going to work this out. Okay, so we cut it in fours only because, you know, my son dropped it. Otherwise we wouldn't be cutting it in fours. So I'm gonna just cut it out this way usually I don't do this I usually cut it in like slices and then I cut the rind I cut it off kind of like the pineapple but this one is a little different so we just cut around it like that and we're gonna cut it in slices we're gonna take these slices stand them on end and then we're gonna cut them in half so now we have watermelon chunks there we go. Boom. So usually what you can do <clears throat> is cut them slices. Okay, but I'm just going to go around the meat of the of the watermelon. Go around. Okay. Go around. And Cut it in slices. Okay, that's from the the fall from earlier today. And cut it in chunks. So slice, cut it in chunks. All right, I need something to put this in. All right, we're gonna do that one more time. Hi, how are you? Who is that? Debbie. Hey, girl. How you doing? I had to pull up my glasses, girl. I, I had to see you with all my four eyes. <laughs> nice to see you, hon. Okay, so we're cutting watermelon right now. And usually I do it in like slices and stuff, but because my son dropped it when we left <laughs> the store, we we're going to have to do it this way. But we're doing some just quick slices, and then we're just chunking it up. 
poor little watermelon didn't even stand a chance. <laughs> He's like, Mom, it slipped. I'm like, oh, my honey. It's all right. We're going to cut it anyway when we get home. No big deal, you know. Can't can't be angry over, <laughs> over the watermelon falling. <laughs> It's all right, no problem, Jay. Okay, so sliced, and then we're going to cut it in chunks. All right, I'm running out of room here. All right, here we go. So I got a nice little Tupperware here. Move this watermelon into the Tupperware. That way, we have already, you know, sliced a watermelon and pineapple for later. So the whole prepping, like, is like one of those things that people just don't like doing. But if you take time, do it right, it makes life so much easier. And you don't have to go, wow, I don't really want to cut that watermelon. Well, guess what? If you do it immediately, it's already cut. Well, you don't have to worry about it. Okay, so take that into slices. I'm going to pour a little dropped watermelon. <sighs> no, it's sadness. <laughs> okay. So we're almost done with this watermelon. Any questions on how to cut fruit? If you guys have any issues, go ahead, drop them in the comments section. If you're not already following me, you really kind of need to because you need this in your life. You need someone to kind of show you the basics. I mean, you can learn how to, you know, cook. How been? I girl, I miss you too, girl. We need to meet up, girl. Like, you close. We need to just meet up. Um, I didn't understand that. Maybe it was like your, I don't even know, spell check or something. Anyway, so now the watermelon is nicely cut and everything like that. Um, let's see. Yeah, I don't even know what that is. Okay, hey, I need fruit. You do? Amen. Yeah, so, anywho... So, um, watermelon, super easy, super fun, it's the perfect summer fruit to get all cut up and ready, and once you cut it up, you put it in your refrigerator, and you have watermelon for days. It's awesome, 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 awesome. So, we just finished cutting up a pineapple. If you missed it, um, girl, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Message me, okay? Let's do it. Um... So, if you guys have already missed the cutting of the pineapple, you need to go go to the replay, check it out, and everything like that. After I end this broadcast, go ahead and hit the follow with the three little dots on the right-hand side. And get the following me, man. Get the following me, because I'm going to be doing amazing things all summer long. And we're just going to have a fun food party. We'll just call it a party, okay? And Sharon's dinner show. So I gotta get out of here now. If you guys don't already know who I am, my name is Sharon. Girl, right? Right. <laughs> um, if you guys don't know who I am, I am Sharon. I've been cooking and baking for 20 years, and you just witnessed me cutting summer fruits, some of your favorite summer fruits, pineapple and watermelon. And so if you guys have any hang-ups, you can take this. Go ahead and watch it. Watch it again. Watch it like 50 million times. That way it gets seeped into your brain. That way you don't have to go out and buy cans of pineapple and get weird about that watermelon and then have weird like jaggedy cuts of your watermelon like wondering I don't really want to eat that because it doesn't look that pretty or I don't really cut it very pretty well guess what showing you how to cut it very very pretty here okay so I gotta get out of here I gotta 
heat up some food for my family. Last night I made some roast chicken with some asparagus and some potatoes. Um, go ahead and check that replay as well. And um, we're going to get out of here. And I hope you guys have a fantastic evening. Debbie, I'm looking for you, girl. I'm looking for you. <laughs> looking for you girl let's meet up i know you're close to me so let's do it i hope you guys have a fantastic evening and thank you guys so much for watching love you